We made it to Paris. All right, the first and last time we went to Paris was four years ago. And it was a very special trip for us because, first of all, Paris, la vie de l'amour. We had a very romantic date. Second, we had a delicious breakfast. And I mean very delicious. And third, just got over her fear of heights and went halfway up the Eiffel Tower. And now, four years later, we're back in Paris, but this time not only for a couple of days, but for a couple of months. Why? Well, because we like this city and we found an apartment with a very good price. We're so excited to be here and the beginning of this trip was already incredible. Because two days after we arrived, a subscriber, shout out to you Cynthia, sent us a message on Instagram and gifted us two tickets to the Harry Styles concert. What? I couldn't believe it. That has never happened to us, ever. <laughs> I'd like to begin by just saying a massive, massive thank you to you. I love you Harry! It was funny because there were like 90% women and 10% guys. But for me it was great because I was one of the tallest ones and I could see over everyone else. <laughs> yeah, I know. But the girls were like yelling very, very loudly. In my ear, right next to me. <laughs> this is the first time I went to a concert, not in a seated area. So I was very scared that I was not gonna be able to see much. I saw Harry Styles from afar like three times. <laughs> <laughs> like for 10 seconds in total? Yeah, the rest I was just looking at the screens. But it was incredible. I had so much fun. It was, yeah, it was a lot of fun. Harry, 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 Harry. Harry, Harry, Harry. Then a couple of days later, I managed to fulfill one of my biggest dreams that I've had since the first time I saw my all time crush. Rafael Nadal on TV winning Roland Garros. <laughs> we went to the French Open. All time crush? All time crush. You still your all time crush? I don't know. Uh, careful, eh? Here's the footage. Here's what the footage. The heck? <laughs> They said straight, left, all the way up, and then left again. Whatever that means. What's going on here? Still nine. We're trying to find somewhere to eat. Everything is pretty expensive here. But I think it could be worse, to be honest. I don't know. I mean, it's super expensive already. Yeah. I mean, a hot dog for nine euros. I expect it to be 15 or so. This is like the main plaza or something. And there, people are watching matches and ads. And there, I wonder if that's where we have to go later. Yeah, Port Philippe Chartier. And now we're gonna walk around randomly. There's just one to buy stuff. Yes. Minutes. Welcome to the French Open! <laughs> I managed to get my goodies. They were very expensive. I bought this cap for like traditional, you know, it's a classic. A keychain. And here's our pre-game snack. Tap with Nutella. Hmm. Yannick and I have officially separated for now because we couldn't find tickets together. So I'm trying to find my spot. I'll let you know when I'm there. This is my view. I'm in the first row of my section, thankfully. And Yanni, this is somewhere there. Look, it seems like all the people that are like, on TV or VIPs are rolling those boots. a German 
player called Sasha. <laughs> And we won! Germany won! Deutschland! 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 I Sasha! I think there's a video from it. One time I was like this. Sasha! <laughs> <laughs> you were too shy. Wow, your light is on. It was so much fun! Au revoir. Au revoir. Au revoir. Au revoir. Au revoir. We're very excited for the next couple of months. This is the place where we're gonna kick off our married life. Who would have thought? So our plan now is to be digital nomading. <laughs> is that a verb? We're digital nomads. Yeah, for at least the rest of this year. Yes. We already have a bunch of places booked. And it's exciting because uh, we haven't lived alone for a long time. It's been a while. And it's been incredible already, I gotta say. <laughs> so now we're kicking it off in Paris. I'm very excited for a couple of things here in Paris. First of all, if Joss is brave enough to go all the way up the Eiffel Tower this time. Oh, I've been looking at it from afar and I realized I only went literally halfway there. Yeah, let's. And it already felt horrible. So, <laughs> I don't know. Otherwise, I'll go with someone else. Okay, then Joss said she would take me to Moulin Rouge. Oh, you're excited about that. So, I'm waiting for that. <laughs> and I'm very excited about all the crepes. Oh, we already ate so many. Yeah, like 10 each. They even have, look, they even sell pre-made crepes in the supermarkets. <laughs> so we can have them non-stop. And we're not working out at all. Dude. <laughs> we just got married and we're gonna be like, who cares? Yeah, now it doesn't matter anymore. <laughs> good idea. No, we need to work out, but the gyms are very expensive. If you have been to Paris or you live here, let us know in the comments what are the best restaurants in Paris, where do you have the best view over Paris, mm -hmm. and what things you would recommend for us to do. Yeah, just let us know what the, what kind of content would you like to see from us here. That's it. That's it. Au revoir. Salut. <laughs>